infestation of locusts in Ethiopia could spread to neighboring countries. The locusts are devouring almost 2 million tons of vegetation a day over an area of about 350 square kilometers, Richard Hamilton reports. It may sound biblical, but this plague of locusts is causing very real damage to modern-day Ethiopia. Since August, the authorities have been trying unsuccessfully to bring the infestation under control. Last week, they sent planes to spray them with insecticide. These locusts are thought to have come from Yemen and have now covered vast swathes of Tigray, Amhara, Oromia and the Somali regional state. Some farmers have lost 100% of their staple crop, teff. Some 30 refugees and asylum seekers in Italy are assuming a strikingly different role this evening in Rome, taken to the stage of the city's opera house for a production of Mozart's Idomeneo. It tells the story of a Cretan king washed up on the shores of his native island after a storm. Many of the migrants are from Africa and the Middle East and reached Europe after making the perilous Mediterranean Sea crossing. BBC World Service News. You're listening to the news from the BBC. The views and comments of the hosts and guests are not necessarily those of the station. This is DZRJ, 810 AM, Radio Bandido, on Radio Vision Channel 224 on Sky Cable Manila, on TV Plus Boxes, and live on radio on DZRJ, 810 AM. Informing, advising, and entertaining the Filipinos and OFWs around the world. Streaming on www.facebook slash DZRJ, 810 AM. <laughs> Roger Broadcasting Network Incorporated, member KBP, kapisangan ng mga broadcasters sa Pilipinas. The views and comments of the hosts and guests are not necessarily those of the station. Radio Bandido, 8-10 a.m. Ah, galang tanghali bayan, this is uh, Good News Pilipinas, uh, DZRJ 8-10 a.m. We're live, uh, Teleradio. And uh, your host, Francis Guzman, and I have a very special guest today. Uh, the good news that is coming in from Israel, my good friend and brother in Christ uh, has just arrived, and he will make a very special report on Jesus' reign celebration, which has reached the land of our God. So uh, before we start uh, the ball rolling, you know, and dami na namin comments that has come in in the past 48 hours, folks. So, uh, and uh, itong, itong, itong event that is coming in on the 30th of this month is very special for our nation, especially now that the nation is undergoing changes, rapid, very fast changes. And, uh, you know, uh, Manila would be the center point of uh, the world's famous uh, Luneta Grandstand in Manila Bay. Can you imagine that? Where history uh, witnessed the impact events, you know, in this year's venue, for the eight anniversary celebrations. Eight, uh, an, eight annual celebrations. Annual celebrations. Yeah, this uh, is nationwide. Nationwide. Uh, our special guest, Brother Albert Tandinko. Welcome, my, my good brother. Yes, uh, in Christ. Thank you for having me, Brother Francis. Glory. Magandang hapon sa inyong lahat, all our oh, dear so listeners. Happy to see you again. <laughs> wow. Okay. Uh, Jesus reigns is celebrated this Sunday, August 30, 1988. We will start uh, around 1 p.m. in the afternoon. Uy, galing. And then uh, mm. it will start off with a March of Declaration. The March of along, Declaration. Along uh, Ross wow. Boulevard. Okay. Oh, <laughs> so we, have, we okay. invite, yeah, we invite mm. all the uh, followers of our Lord Jesus, the yes. body of Christ, to all come together. Now we uh, arise and just uh, declare the lordship and kingship of uh, Jesus upon our cities, our nation. And we're going to do this declaration through a march. Wow, we'll wonderful. Walk through the, from uh, Luneta, we'll transverse the uh, Ross Boulevard all the way to Quirino and come back. <laughs> yes, and then after coming back, we will have a wonderful uh, yes, worship and prayer celebration uh, at the Quirino Grandstand. Tremendous. Ito yung, ito yung uh, nakikita ko na annual, ano, yung Parade of Flags ba yan? Right? Yes. Oh, oh. Uh, the Parade of Flags is oh. part of uh, our Grand Parade. Oy. So we have uh, we march with the uh, Flags of the Nations Oy, because we are also mm. declaring 
the lordship and kingship over all the nations of the world. Oh, that's wonderful. No, of course, he's not For just sight, oh, he's know. just not king over the Philippines, but uh, oh. of the entire earth. Tremendous, you know, with the brilliant, you know, costumes and all that, you no? Know? Yes. So. Wonderful guy. And uh, yeah. the, the great right. news, the yes, good yes, news yes. is that uh, this this is not only happening uh, in uh, Metro Manila, but it is simultaneously happening in all 82 provinces of the Philippines. Sabay-sabay. Grabe, right. no? Kita uh, mo from, naman. Uh, from Batanes uh, all the way down to Tawi-Tawi. Wow! <laughs> all 82 provinces will, be, will be coming together to do this. It's just yes. wonderful, huh? And we've been doing this for eight years. This oh, is the eighth year. Yeah. This is the eighth. Wow, wonderful right. year. Alam mo, uh, mga kababayan ko, ano, uh, itong, itong pioneering effort ng Philippine celebration of a uh, reverential praise and true worship to our one and only Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, you know, has reached the key cities and nations of the world. Mm -hmm. And uh, this includes, uh, among others, you know, Japan, Indonesia, the United States, uh, and other countries, uh, Brother Albert. Yeah, the, right now, it's oh. these uh, three main nations that are really with us. Tremendous. Uh, oh. Japan, Indonesia, and uh, the U.S. But uh, in, in, in each of these countries, it's also expanding. True. <laughs> you know, uh, oh. these nations, they have, they have seen what uh, is happening in our country mm -hmm. and how the Lord is uh, blessing this nation. So they, they would want to copy. You know, they are convicted to do the same thing. For example, in Japan, yes, where uh, the celebration started, uh, I believe, in uh, year 2016. 2016? Yes, oh, it started okay. with one celebration in Tokyo. Mm -hmm. uh, but as of last year, their uh, fourth year, okay. uh, it's done now in uh, simultaneously in five prefectures in Tremendous. Japan. Tremendous, five already? Five, yeah. Wow. And uh, okay. they are praying that uh, very soon yes. they can do it simultaneously in all uh, 47 prefectures. Ayun, dami! <laughs> uh, that's the whole wow, of Japan. The whole of Japan. <laughs> the whole of Japan. <laughs> okay. And, uh, wow. In, mm. and uh, in the U.S., Yes, brother. Uh, this year mm -hmm. we were... Uh, we were invited to visit uh, nine different uh, states in the in the U.S. to share this uh, wonderful vision. Amen. And so uh, they are so much inspired. And uh, so 2020, oh, we're going to see uh, several excited. several places in on <laughs> hmm. mainland USA. Tremendous. We'll come together to, to to honor the Lord you know, simultaneously. You know wow. the 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 USA. Uh, they really need the Lord now. Uh, it's very <laughs> critical and crucial hmm. time of their history. Oh, and I, 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 uh, sa ating ano, no, mga, uh, we've been observing, Brother Albert, yung nangyayari sa Amerika, grabe. Hmm. You know, uh, they're being rocked. Hmm. The Lord is shaking them. That's right. And then, uh, I think they're preparing for their um, presidential elections, no? Yes, uh, with so, so then, much uh, oh. controversy surrounding hmm. that, uh, that upcoming election. That you know? <laughs> We oh, really tama. need the, uh, the strong hand of the Lord Amen. upon the USA. Intervention and Jones. You know, it's so important mm -hmm. because uh, what happens to the US hap will affect the entire world. It will affect oh, our oh, nation. That's right? very true. Yeah. Oh, oh. So we 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 could not uh, we can could not be complacent about this. Yes. So we'd like to enjoy <laughs> uh, our listeners to, oh. to always include uh, the United States <laughs> yes. in their in, prayers. In the prayers, wonderful, right. brother. That's a wonderful, uh, no, uh, reminder to all of us. And uh, folks, you know, uh, pro this provided, you know, uh, the open doors to the peoples of the world, and uh, the privilege to give honor and glory to the living God of Israel, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob and completely worship Him in spirit and in truth. No? Uh, indeed, God's word found in the scriptures will find its fulfillment. Amen. Amen. The highly memorable event, Jesus reigns, is open to all. An invitation open to all people. And it is free. <laughs> it's given free. Just like salvation is given free. Brother Albert. Brother Francis, yeah, yes. uh, to talk about it, right? Wonderful, yeah, yes. Uh, yes, it is open. To all, it's an open invitation to all. Yes, man. Uh, but it would be wonderful for everybody, you know, uh, to understand more because uh, the the essence of coming together, together. Is, is to give oh. honor and to worship the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords. <laughs> you know, so uh, we we're not coming together to 
just to celebrate, yes. just to be entertained or to have fun. No, no, it's not about that. No, the, the, the basic essence of why we come together is to give honor to the king. The king of kings. The honor, king of Lord kings. Of Lords and, yes, no? and so wow. we, we, would, uh, we need to have a preparation of heart. Ah, yeah, that's no, we very should have important. that inner oh. desire mm. no, to, to really uh, to honor God. Yes, you know, and uh, to to prepare the heart so that when we go there, you know, it is it is uh, in a way it's something that we are giving to to the Lord. We are ministering to God. No, uh, it's not it's not it's less about ourselves, but it's more about, more about uh, giving wow. giving to God. No, that's something mm. very important uh, for us now to understand more about uh, worship. That's true. what worship is. No, uh, many many people uh, have this idea that uh, worship is uh, singing. Oh, you know, singing some uh, <laughs> Christian songs, some mm. religious songs. You yes. know that it is uh, a tradition. No, but it's so much more. Much no, much more. So much right. more. A, yeah, a, a true worship worship. done with a sincere heart, done in mm. spirit and in truth. Yes. No, uh, touch the very heart of God. I love that. I yes, love that yes. statement. Brother, uh, we've been having uh, questions left and right, no? mm -hmm. even uh, 48 hours before the program, no? <laughs> two days. And uh, uh, one of these ones include, can worship break anxieties? Brother, Brother Albert, true worship. Huh? Yes. Uh, you know, uh, mm. anxieties, no? uh, the worries of life, mm. challenges of life, no? it haunts all of us. Like, no, uh, no matter mm -hmm. where we find ourselves in all walks of lives, no, uh, the very, very rich is not exempted mm -hmm. from oh, anxieties. Oh, in fact, oh. in fact, uh, most yes. likely <laughs> they have even more stress. No, then, then, or then <laughs> yes, no. For example, if the uh, stocks goes up and down, no, you know, stocks. Okay. yeah, uh, for them to mm. to to own so much uh, assets, and if something is affecting one. Oh boy. It gives them anxiety, <laughs> no? Uh, <laughs> I, I subscribe to this, brother. Yes, yes. That not, not, nothing occupy. two things cannot occupy the same space. Uh, yeah, two okay? Things. <laughs> two things cannot <laughs> occupy the same space. The same way, two thoughts cannot mm -hmm. occupy your mind at the same exact time. At the same time. <laughs> okay? No matter how uh, you're a multitasker, etc. Yeah. But you can only hold one thought at a time. Oh, hindi ka kayanin. <laughs> That's right. No? So, if we will give our focus mm -mm. to the Lord, mm -mm. No? just focusing on Him, right. okay. uh, communicating with Him, worshipping Him, yes. you know, uh, our anxieties will really have to vacate our mind. <laughs> <laughs> like All right, and instead, <laughs> and instead, uh, as we as we worship the Lord, mm -hmm. we allow the peace, the joy, the joy of the Lord, Lord the yes. confidence yes. that we have in the Lord to to wow. to replace wow. us, wow. to fill mm -hmm. fill us up, mm -hmm. you know, and and that is what what God wants that He regularly invites us. You know, uh, one of the very beautiful Bible verses that uh, yes, um, we see is, uh, is the invitation of Jesus. He says, come all of you who are heavily laden. Oh, I like that right? word. You know, lay, your, lay your burdens upon me. You know, come and learn from me. You know, uh, share my yoke, you know, for it is easy. You know, uh, so wow. that, that's what the Lord is saying. You know? uh, let's lay down our anxieties, our worries, you know, our mistakes, you know, on Him. On him. You know, uh, the reason why we are so stressed out is because yes. we're carrying all of that. In our own. Uh, uh, yeah, yes, and we, on our own shoulders, you know, and, uh, yes, and we, we don't know where to lay them down. Oh, you know, the yeah, problem uh, with them. Right? Oh, you know, that's true. And uh, that, that's the invitation of our Lord Jesus. Lay, them, lay them upon yeah. the Lord. Wonderful. While you were saying that, ano, na remind ko, Brother mm -hmm. Albert, tatlong B. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's a <laughs> three B? Burden, uh, bearer, and breaker. Breaker. It's him. Yes. It's him. Bandits breaker. Yes. The Lord alone. Yeah. Lord bearer. Uh, You're right. Wow, yeah. wonderful. He, he breaks the yoke. 
of bondages. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, the next question that we've been receiving, Tung, ano, what mm -hmm. set values can we uh, receive from attending? Uy, magandang itong question. The Jesus Reign Celebration. Set values, brother Albert. Mm -mm. Yes, the most sorry. important okay. thing, I believe, the, yes. that we would learn, and I think this is a very important thing that all of us have to learn, Yes, brother. is to take our focus from ourselves. Oy. <laughs> take our focus from what is happening like to us uh -huh. and to turn our focus on the Lord mm -hmm. and what He wants to happen in our lives okay. and the, pur the purposes of the Lord. The Lord invites us to do that. In another uh, wonderful verse in the Bible, it says, uh, Seek ye first Seek the you kingdom first. Like and this. the righteousness of God. Seek you first. And there's a promise that is attached to that commandment. Okay. It says, Then all of these things will be added unto you. Added. All, no? So what the Lord is saying, that if we, we will learn to focus on Him, mm -hmm. What is important to the Lord, His commandments, the way He wants us to live and to uh, work with people, then all these other bandages and all yes. these anxieties, no, He can easily take take care Remove of that. Mm, that is mm. the that is the honest truth. Yes, brother. Well, well. You know, people would like to say miracles, miracles, but they are blessings from the Lord. Amen. It I is know. because once we learn to channel. No, we channel our focus on Him. Mm -hmm. So this is something we can learn yes, in, in this uh, Jesus Reign celebration. One so of the most important, important yeah. value uh, is to, mm -hmm. to help us focus on the Lord Jesus, on God. No, we have a, a, one of our core values, we, we call it anonymity. Oh, yeah, like this. Ano okay. anonymity. anonymity. It is uh, one of the declarations of uh, John the Baptist in the Bible. He says... Uh, he, which means the Lord, He must increase and I must decrease. Oh, I love that. Okay? that is so, a, more okay. about the Lord, mm -hmm. less about myself. Mm -hmm. You know, think about it. If, if we stay focused on ourselves and our yes. problem and our challenges, we experience this. A small problem becomes bigger and bigger. Mm. <laughs> right? <laughs> no, as, as this problem uh, goes around our head mm -hmm. and we would not let it go and it keeps going, a small problem becomes a big problem, mm. you know, well, and it takes over our lives, right? right? Yeah, and uh, we, we, we need help to let go of these things. Amen. And what better way but to rechannel our focus on our wonderful Lord. Amen. We need Jesus. Amen. 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 Yeah. Oh, wonderful value, huh, Brother Albert? Huh? Yes. That's humility. Yeah. Another, oh, another yes. important value mm -hmm. that yes, uh, yes, we, we gather mm -hmm. from uh, this celebration yes. is the importance of Becoming united, oh, like becoming this. a family. Unity, okay. Yeah. Okay, the unity of the body. The unity Christ. of the body. Okay. Okay. You know, uh, we have a lot of uh, no, lot of history in the yeah, body of Christ. Uh -oh. No, and we the body of Christ is composed of uh, very imperfect people. Ay, okay, mo pa. and <laughs> weak people. Yeah. Okay, including us. Oh, what we, <laughs> brother, we are the worst, right? Yeah, we, we are, are the, the worst, worst. Ito, yan, right? Except for the grace and the faithfulness yes. of God. Amen. And so because I, of that, mm -hmm. uh, we have a lot of issues. You know, we have hurt each other. Mm -hmm. We have stepped on each other. And there's so much history. Mm -hmm. And trying to go back to try to heal all of that, it's almost impossible. Totoo, right? It's I almost know. impossible. Yeah. And before one thing is, is sold, mm. may bagong issue may na naman. Na bago. <laughs> right. No, no? So, so when will we ever be truly united? Mm. No, Jesus reigns is teaching us that if we would rechannel our focus on the yeah. Lord Jesus and what is the agenda of God, the then, agenda of God, yes, the agenda of God, then mm. All our differences and all our other issues yes, brother. Uh, will naturally fade into the background. Just disappear. <laughs> not really disappear, but, but they, they suddenly oh. they are not that important. Suddenly, I like that word, suddenly. Yeah, we will find because okay. we have rechanneled again, we have rechanneled our focus on oh. the Lord. Mm -hmm. Right? Suddenly. And and because of that, and if if it's one of us sincerely seek after the Lord then we will suddenly find ourselves 
or naturally find ourselves in unity with one another. I love that. Seek Him. I, I believe first. that is I one of the God. most important, mm -hmm. what should yeah. I say, secret or secret. one of the most important <laughs> things that us, as the body of Christ, we need to learn. You know, we, we need to understand all the differences we have, all the arguments we have, all the, shall we say, pride oh, that we have. Right. You know, it's very displeasing to the Lord. And it hurts the Lord. Oh, yeah, it, it hurts the Lord mm -mm. to see to see we're fighting all the time. Oh, like little children. You know, mad madali lang naman eh. You try to uh -oh. picture. Mm. Tayo uh -oh. bilang uh, padre di familia. Okay? Right, yeah, yeah, Being right, a father right. after a hard day's work, mm. we go home, mm. and then we see all our children fighting, Ay. arguing with one another. Okay, uh, what do you feel? Right? Uh, okay. Masasaktan ka. Mm. Right? And so, that's the heart of the Father. The heart of God. Yes, wow. the heart of God. Oh, wonderful. So that's why, you know, uh, one of the last commandments yes. of our Lord Jesus before, before he, he, he allowed himself no, to, yeah. to be crucified on the cross, he made this statement. He said, uh, a new commandment I give you. Love one another as I have loved you. I love one, love one another as I have loved you. We, we can use the love that the Lord gave us. We are all recipient of the great love and grace of God. Amen. No, and then if we can use that to love our brother, you know, the kind of love we receive from the Lord, mm. that's the that's the one we reflect. No, no, no. Don't try to don't try to find something within yourself, but use the love of God to love others. Oh, you become. Then you'll be you'll be yes. Then you you bring healing to one another. You know, it becomes easy. It's totally easy because. God's love is. We 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 we're loving out of the overflow of God. <laughs> Thank you. That's a beautiful reminder. Okay, Brother Albert. Okay, as uh, the main coordinator for Jesus Reigns you know, for seven years, brother, what progress have you observed or the challenges you've seen in people? Ano yung nakita mo, Brother Albert? Ano yung witness mo? Well, you, uh, I have been uh, as a, I was assigned to yes. to do coordination uh, together with my team. Oh, with yes, the team to go around the, uh, the whole of Luzon mm -hmm. and uh, NCR. Yes. Sir. No, through the years I have seen uh, the body, the body of Christ, the churches, the pastors, oh. people, mm -hmm. uh, changing. I, I like no, uh, okay. differences have mm -hmm. been set aside. Mm -hmm. They have now learned to work together. You know, enjoy fellowship together. Yes. You know, and uh, I, I believe the Philippines, as a result, is already in revival. It's oh, in revival. Good news, huh? Oh, you know, uh, okay. and now uh, in 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 one of your earlier programs where yes, I, I'm, I I had the privilege to be here, we talk about also what the effect was with the in the government sector. Oh, oh important. Right? Mm -hmm. No, no. It's not that our government has no problems, but. Mm -hmm. But we have made so much progress. Right. You know, we, we, this government has been addressing what needs to be addressed. Mm -hmm. You know, the problem is very big, but it's being addressed now. Slowly. You know, we have to be patient. Oh, little by little. Yeah, little, little by little. By step, you know, and, and, and the Lord is also blessing and protecting this nation. We have, Amen. We have a lot of earthquakes. Oh, what? Right? right? Just shaking. Oh. Ne never before have we seen one after the Should other. Almost every day. Right. But oh. considering mm. the kind of damages and the mm. loss of life yes. is, is in a way uh, small compared to what could have been. Do you, oh, you understand? Oh, understand? You, you, you see oh. these things happening in, in mm. other nations and other places and... The damage is tremendous. Devastating. Right. Oh, you know? yeah, and uh, mm -hmm. you, you try to imagine, mm -hmm. for example, uh, this yes, super well, typhoon, Hagibis. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Hagibis. Okay. You know, uh, 
it did not even come near the Philippines. Imagine that. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a it's a uh, category five typhoon. Lakas noon. Yeah, something like Yolanda. Oh, oh that's very strong. Mm. Right, and uh, it did not oh. even touch us. Okay. It spared the nation. Tremendous. That's right, and uh, oh. so this this nation is uh, is being blessed and protected by the Lord. Amen. I and it is so great. important that uh, all of us, you no, know, either you are you are religious or not mm -hmm. religious, for us yeah. to recognize that. I like you know, and and recognizing that we need to have a heart of gratefulness, the heart of gra gratitude, gratitude like, okay. that we we gratitude. every day we will mm. thank God for that. Mm -hmm. You know, look out the window; you can see the sunshine today. What a beautiful day! Yes, you know, may, right. maybe, <laughs> maybe it's hot, but we are. <laughs> You know, there's there's a shade. No? <laughs> yeah. Okay, Probably. and uh, it's beautiful here in the Philippines. <laughs> we agree, right? I and, agree. Uh, let's have let let's be mm. thankful to the Lord. Let's continue to honor Him, Great. lift Him ever higher. You no, know, seek Him, for it's one of us. You no, know, uh, God is never far. God is so near. It's one. If you would own this. If we would only humble ourselves and seek Him out, mm -hmm. He would be found. You know, and all of us together, we will enjoy the blessing. Amen. He's just a call away. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, uh, no. There was a song humility. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Yes. You know, that's why it's, uh, sometimes uh, uh, it is it is during very difficult times that yes, that people. That people uh, find the Lord, <laughs> oh, especially yeah, in, in difficult times. Yeah, because in in good times, you know, uh, we, we are enjoying too much. Okay, <laughs> yes. and so sometimes the Lord will will have to allow uh, challenging times into mm -hmm. our lives, and if we recognize that, mm -hmm. it's just the Lord reminding us, oh, you know, to to draw near to Him, no, then, like like a father. Saying, anak, yeah. tama. Oh, nandito papa mo. No, tama. No, and uh, if we, if we, if uh, we, uh, this is my my yeah. own my own conviction. Uh, if during the good times mm -hmm. we learn to always be thankful and we are always drawn near to God, mm -hmm. then I believe we will have even more good times. <laughs> Greater. No, if, if every time we have a good time, we are in good times and we forget Him, mm -hmm. then. Uh, Mababawasan yung good time kasi para, para we, we would come near to him, di ba? It's, it's, it's quite logical, right? Mm. Yeah. Isang bata na ano, di ba? Yung anak na saktan or na ano. Mm. Tapos he runs to his papa, mm. di ba? Mm. The father is there just waiting and come son. <laughs> that's right. That's right. That's right. I wonder so, whatever. That's, that's what's ano. And yes. uh, we are we're in, a, in good times here in... Uh, in the Philippines now, yes. and sana all of us, no, no. Instead of uh, attacking one another, mm -hmm. why don't we just cooperate with one another? You know, cooperate with the government. Mm -hmm. Pray for the government. Pray, pray. for our president yeah. and mm -hmm. uh, our vice president mm -hmm. and uh, the whole uh, government. You know, so that uh, this nation will uh, oh, rise unity. up faster. Oh, mm -hmm. the unity of the nation. Yeah. Oh, it's very important. Thank you for that reminder. <laughs> That's right. In fact, uh, reminder din sa akin, folks, when we wake up in the morning, yeah. uh, great is thy faithfulness, O Lord, unto me. Yeah, but there's a song of gratitude. Yes. And, uh, okay, Brother Albert. And uh, wow, I, I just reminded, uh, and daming questions nito, Brother Albert. Huh? It's trending. Okay, Which is more fulfilling to you, attending a concert or gathering or going to worship celebrations? And why? I grab it all, Brother Albert. Mm -hmm. People spend a lot of money going to <laughs> the, the concert of uh, really uh, oh. mga oh, world different. famous bands. Oh, you know, oh. you know uh, mm. spend thousands and thousands of That's pesos. Oh, and, uh, you see uh, these mm -hmm. young people uh, mm -hmm. losing themselves in mm -hmm. that uh, music, mm -hmm. you know. But we need to understand that there is a spirit behind everything. There is a spirit. That's wow. right, you know. And uh, if we will be, if we will be honest with ourselves, we'll examine the lyrics mm. of the modern music. And there's so many bad things. Oh, good, okay. 
curse words, talking about the wrong things, you know, uh, a negative culture that is being planted into the lives of our young people. That's the danger. That's the danger of uh, the current musical trend right now. It's been going on for a while. Mm -hmm. Yes, right. You know, and uh, it's very addicting. Oh my goodness. But it is not doing any good to the psyche of our young people. Oh, especially the no. youth, no? The okay. next generation. And But worship is totally different. You know, I, we have been mm -hmm. talking about it uh, ever uh, since the, uh, we started the program. It's really about connecting with the Lord, you know, absorbing uh, the wonderful things from the Lord. You know, uh, humbling ourselves before the Lord and uh, good things. It changes us. It changes. When we talk about mm. uh, you know our our bondages are mm -hmm. are disappearing. It's being is is uh, being tear tear apart. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, uh, we our peace within us is restored. Mm -hmm. you know, so it's a it's a no brainer. <laughs> <laughs> no, if we have a, if we if yeah. we have the chance, no. Mm. Some sometimes I, 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 you know, I when I listen to the beautiful worship songs, and I say, uh, what what's the main difference of a beautiful worship song versus a beautiful secular song? Oh, yeah, I like to hear this. Okay. Right, right, on, right. Okay. In the secular song, you just enjoy it. Okay. Maybe it brings uh, back some memories. Oh, young memories right. of the oh, last hour. Oh, oh. But the beautiful oh. worship song mm -hmm. connects you to the heart of God. Ah, ang ganda ng difference noon. Okay, so mm -hmm. that's it. Straight to the heart of God. Yeah. Our straight to the heart of mm -hmm. uh, the one who had uh, created. Mm -hmm. It's one of us. Ang ganda nito mga ano, comments, no, brother. I, I, will, uh, I will honor our, uh, our people uh, who have, uh, you know, mm -hmm. come up with their... Mm -hmm. uh, answers and questions too, mm -hmm. no? Mm -hmm. Sabi dito ni Raji uh, Bernada, I choose worship celebration. Concert only entertains you temporarily. Sabi niya, while worship celebrations is your connect with the one who created you. It's what we're saying while well, Yes, no. that's right. That is right. <laughs> oh. That is right. And then, uh, sabi naman ni, ano, uh, ang dami eh. Uh, brother, I'm just... Uh, Okay, uh, ni Leon Gra. Uh, oh, this is a ano. Uh, sabi niya, good morning po. The best po ang program ninyo. Thank you, ha. Uh, lemon grass. Lemon grass that, iced tea. <laughs> iced tea. Okay. Uh, a refreshing oh, name. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I don't. Sabi niya, I don't see anything wrong. Naman po sa Christian worship, mm -hmm. concerts or gathering. It depends po siguro sa way or style. Meron kasi na sobrang artistic na nawawala na yung focus sa Lord. This is what you were saying. Focus That's on, right. On Jesus. No, it's not. It's not just oh. about uh, us which are listening, but yes. the the worship we call them the worship leaders. Oh yes, uh, right. it's very important that uh, they're doing true worship. You know, of, of course, uh, as human, oh. there's always the temptation to mm -hmm. to turn it into a performance. Performance. <laughs> yes. And then once oh. we start to do that, if it's something that uh, you know. Not mm -hmm. really sincere, then, then we lose the essence of worship. Beautiful. We lose it. Mm -hmm. Beautiful, he said, Brother yeah. Albert. Sabi nga niya, in bottom line, tawan tawan siya nabin mo. Main focus is Jesus, and all glory must belong to God. Ganda. Mm -hmm. So, uh, and, and from Miguel Amada, worship gatherings because it helps me to draw nearer to God. Amen. Oh, Amen. Yeah, tremendous. And uh, si Edith, no? Uh, okay, uh, folks, we'll be back. Uh, good news, Filipinas. We have so many uh, questions and answers that has to be done. Mabuhay po kayo. You're listening to DZRJ 810 AM. We'll be right back after these reminders. That Time Check was brought to you by Columbia International Food Products. Maligayang Pasko mula sa Columbia. Ako po si Commissioner Dennis Puna ng Insurance Commission. Hindi kailan na bata man o matanda, maaaring maging biktima ng sakuna. Kaya't lahat tayo ay kailangan ng insurance. Ngunit kapag bata pa at malakas pa, minsan nakakaligtaan nating maghanda. Ang isang daang premium na pwede mong bayaran ngayong 25 years old ka ay siguradong magmamahal kapag ikaw ay 35 na. Kaya't ang insurance commission ay nirerekomenda na magsimula na maaga. Tawagan ang mga lisensyadong ahente galing sa mga lisensyadong kumpanya upang malaman ang inyong options. 
merong life insurance at variable insurance na tama para sa'yo. Mas mura ang insurance pag nagsimula ng maaga. Isang mensahe mula sa Insurance Commission, BIA at nangintilang ito. Attention all music lovers! Here's another Bistro RJ Legends Night coming up. Wednesday, November 27, 8 p.m. at RJ Bistro Dusitani Hotel. Revive those warm memories in your hearts as you listen to Douglas Masuda do Elvis Presley, Inger Santa Maria do Tom Jones, Edwin Kando do Johnny Mathis, Janeline Borja as Brenda Lee. Christmas tree Michael Cole as Freddie Mercury. AJ Hapor as Olivia Newton John. And RJ as Paul McCartney. These local artists will pay tribute to seven legends. So why don't you sing along? Be happy and be there with your friends. For reservations, call. 0906-221-1524 I repeat, 0906-221-1524 Or visit us at www.facebook.com slash RJ Bistro See you there for another Bistro RJ Tribute to Legends Night Wednesday, November 27, 8 p.m. RJ Bistro Dusitani Hotel Radio Bandido, 8, 10 a.m. Yes, folks, we're back. Uh, Good News Filipinas, uh, DCRJ, 8, 10 a.m. This is your host, Francis Le Guzman, and my special guest, <laughs> Albert Andami. Good afternoon Maganda. again. Oh, yes, magandang hapon. everyone. Ang ganda ng mga insights na binigay mo, Albert, na kasi ang tremendous ng impact ng mga tao rito. And, uh, and one of them said, si Ferdinand Gonzalez, mm-hmm. regular to. The concert gatherings should have a clearer kingdom objective, sabi niya. If there is none, then it is just like reminiscing songs that you like. Sinabi mo ito, Robert. I think one of the best objectives of a concert should be evangelistic. Singing songs about salvation, goodness to the Lord, of the Lord, to the multitude of lost and saved yet audiences. Ang ganda. Thank you, mm-hmm. uh, Ferdinand. Mm-hmm. Okay, but Albert, you were <laughs> mentioning no, about I was just listening. Oh. <laughs> I was just listening to uh, the, uh, uh, the 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 uh, the, 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 the upcoming oh, upcoming oh, oh, special uh, event uh, the, by R J. You know, oh, on uh, songs, about so, the old songs. Old songs. I, I'm a music lover. Yes. I, I, oh, and then <laughs> maybe I need to qualify what I've been saying. Oh. No, music <laughs> is really good, you know, and uh, they they really refreshes the soul. Yeah, One way or the, the other. I agree, hundred no, uh, percent. It's just important about uh, the the kind of lyrics, mm. no? You you have, and then uh, but but it uh, music is a gift of the Lord. Amen. From it's, us, no. I I'm not saying that uh, nah, that all our songs and all our music has to be uh, God focused all the time. Mm. Okay, we can enjoy uh, art, beauty, you know, and uh, that Culture, includes the music. You know, yes, no. There's a lot of fun music. Right. Around that uh, refreshes us. No? You clean and, and no, no yes, clean. Yes, yes, yeah. oh, So tamo, tamo, tamo. anyway, we will. Uh, mm-hmm. I I really enjoy the music of RJ. It's same here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> He's the king of rock and roll. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Not in. So okay, brother Albert, we're back and. Uh, Meron ditong tanong na address sa'yo, Brother Albert, can you... Uh, ah, yeah. so, uh, the question is, sabi uh, in Tagalog, in Tagalog it says, okay. uh, may plano ba ang pamunuan ng JRPC Uy. na makaroon ng anthem song ang event na ito? No, it's, uh, it can be Tagalog or English. Oh, uh, uh, do you know the, the de facto theme song? <laughs> no, uh, of uh, our celebration hmm. is... Uh, there's a very anointed song. No, It's called... Okay. Philippines is for Christ. Oh, you, you know that song. I know that song. It's a very beautiful, oh. uh, anointed song. Ah, and ka. yes, yes, that's our de facto theme song. I beautiful. believe. You know, I it, it might not be announced officially as that, oh. but uh, every celebration yeah. and uh, every opportunity we have, we oh. include that because uh, you know, uh, it's the we, official. <laughs> yeah, it's 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 okay. really in essence that that uh, we are dedicating our nation for the Lord Jesus. To his kingship. Ay, ang ganda. No? That, that song is really touching. Yung pag narinig nyo yan, folks. Anointed. Very anointed. Oh, oh. Yeah. It will touch your heart. Mm. In fact, the other mm. nations are adopting that. Uy, 
Yeah. Ganun na, so we said the nations are for Christ. Already, wow. Not only not only the not Philippines only the is for Philippines, Christ, uh, but uh, you know nations, the different it's a nations. Declaration, huh? Yes, yes. It's tremendous, huh? That's power. It's being adopted now uh, oh. internationally. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. Si Marlene Craig, my my you know colleague here in RJ. Mm -hmm. uh, Marlene, I go for worship event and most especially on a Sabbath day. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm more of a fanatic fan of God than concerts. <laughs> Marlene, okay. <laughs> amen, amen, yeah. Okay. Brother <laughs> Albert, I want you to tell us the good news of what happened in Israel during your your uh, travel there recently. Yeah. Uh oh Yes, Brother Albert. One of the uh, very important things we, we do every year yes. uh, in uh, Jesus Reigns, okay. we, we, we organize a what we call a prophetic tour prophetic to like israel it. every year yearly to okay. Uh, okay and it, it coincides with the their celebration of uh, the feast of tabernacles oh that's very important it's a, oh. it's, a it's a very wonderful mm. time of coming right. together oh. you know and uh yes brother it's a it, 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 it coincides uh you know the nations comes yes. together in Israel, particularly at this time, to come together and yes. to bless Israel. Wow. The nations, you know, if, if you have the opportunity to come mm. during this time, you see the nations coming together. Sama, sama you know, we have uh, the highlight of uh, mm. this uh, celebration. Uh, is, uh, it's called the Jerusalem March. Wow. Now, organized by the international... Uh, Jerusalem ICEJ, March? what do you call that? International oh. uh, uh, ICEJ Consulate. Oh, oh, oh. No? Yan, that's oh. uh, a pioneering effort there yes, in yes, Israel. Yes. No, mga Christians. Uh, it, oh. it brings the nations together. Oh. And we, we march, uh, there will be thousands and thousands of us. We will march through the streets of uh, old Jerusalem. Wait, talaga, yeah, in the Jer Jerusalem. Yes, wow. yes. Okay. And uh, hmm. the Jerusalem city. And then you will see all the uh, Israelites, no, uh, old people, all the way to young people and babies lining up uh, in the entire land, no, of the parade. Oh. And we will be able to interact with them. We will be able to bless them, and they would thank us. You can see the gratitude in their faces, you know. Oh, because uh, you know, Israel, Israel. Uh, it's very hard to understand, but it's an isolated nation. That they, they, so many, so many people, nations, uh, hated Israel without really understanding why. <laughs> you know, <laughs> yung, uh, it's called mm. uh, anti-Semitism. Oh, anti-Semitism. Oh, right? oh, that is what, ano niyan, eh? And uh, <laughs> even in the United Nations, mm -hmm. you know, there's all of these uh, very biased resolutions. Man in and man out against the nation of Israel. Parang no? Yeah. Oh, it's right. very, very hard to understand why it is so. You know, Israel is a very small nation. Yes. Occupying a very, very small piece of land. You know, it is not hurting anybody. In fact, Israel as a nation has been such a blessing. That's very true. To the I world really with these yes. technologies, mm -hmm. you know, Mga and uh, high tech na yeah, so, so many, <laughs> yeah, so many of the things we're wow. using now, it, it originated mm -hmm. by, uh, create and uh, invented by, by Isra oh, Israelites, you know? and it's been such a blessing. But we, you know, they, they, they are, they, they, they are going through a very difficult time because of the hate trade hatred that they are experiencing. And so I think this is very important for us who, uh, people of the Lord, we know yes, that uh, uh, Israel is, uh, is chosen by the Lord. Amen. Now, if you believe the Bible, the Bible says that when the Lord Jesus returns physically, yes. and it's happening very soon, and set up his throne upon the earth to rule the earth, physically, that throne room will be in Jerusalem. Mount Zion. Okay, so City of there's, there's no question yeah. about that. Yeah, you know? yes. So this is such a special mm -hmm. place and such special people. 
you know the lord has chosen them and i believe i, I believe that uh all of us who who love jesus you know we need to support israel we need to come together and bless them the bible even says i will bless those who bless you amen you know, one cool. of the reason why uh the philippines is being blessed is because of yes. also of the very positive relationship we maintain with Israel. That's true. And yeah. it all started mm. way, way back, right? Remember when during yeah. that voting, very crucial voting in mm. the UN. Remember, mm. you mm. you mentioned that uh, during one of our yes. programs. Na yes. Yeah, in the, uh, mm. when, when uh, in the UN, when United it was uh, the issue about Israel becoming a nation or not mm. is being voted upon. Right. right. Uh, it won by a very... Slim margin, I think a vote of one. A vote of one. A majority of one vote. And the Philippines voted. <laughs> well, yeah, without our vote, we it would have not have went through. So that's why we, we, we go to Israel. Any Filipino who wants to go to Israel, is uh, it's visa-free. It's visa-free. Oh, I the ambassador, it's visa-free, I remember. In fact, uh, Brother Albert, uh, the good news today, you know, folks, uh, Israel has opened doors also for our uh, mga kababayan who want to go there and work, no? Mm -hmm. When uh, mm -hmm. you were in Israel, Brother Albert, the monitor mm -hmm. ko yung uh, ng news ng uh, Israel na uh, they're accepting Filipinos, not only caregivers, huh? uh, Brother Albert, but also uh, people uh, who have the talent to sa uh, housekeeping, mm -hmm. no? Sa mga hotels and all mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's wonderful mm -hmm. news sa yeah. ating mga manggagawa, no? Mga Filipino. Yes, Brother Albert, uh, any more uh, exciting good news from, from the land of Israel? Uh, so, mm -hmm. we, 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 uh, we have this annual uh, prophetic tour going, okay. oh, which okay. we would like to open to everybody who, are, who would be interested. Oh, no? No. Uh, we go there during uh, <laughs> Next year, the time of the Feast of Tabernacles. Ah, so, it's, so it's, it's normally around late September or uh, early October. No? Uh, October. And we go there not as a uh, sightseeing tour. Okay. Of course, we see the sights. No? But uh, for us, we, every place we go, we, we try to understand the significance yeah. of you know, every, every square inch okay. of Israel has a biblical significance. Okay. <laughs> no, sa totoo lang. Mm -hmm. And, and uh, each one will get help affirm how real the Bible is. No, the Bible is not a fantasy story. It's not based on imaginary things. But it is solid, it is concrete, it is firm. And being able to step on the land of Israel, you will witness that. That is so real. You know, For example, sailing along uh, the Sea of Galilee. Oh, yeah, I want to hear this. Uh, going through the wilderness where the Lord Jesus spent a lot of time... Uh, sharing the word of the lord and uh healing the sick you know uh dealing with uh, the demon possessed you know opening the eyes of the blind you know you see all of these places you saw those no hindi lang ganon you 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 also the 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 story and the events of the old testament become alive you no know, in this uh this last trip we went no we actually visit the memorial graves of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Really? What, what? Sa, sa, Imagine that. <laughs> no, the, the Cape of uh, Machpelah. No? Okay. Yeah, we, we, were, we, we visited those places. Ah, okay. you know, and uh, we, we even uh, visit the place where uh, the wells of Abraham and Jacob. Oh, nakita niyo yun. <laughs> yes. Wells, okay. And so, you know, uh, the Bible is so real. No, it's real. Oh, history. Yeah. As yes. it is, really. Yes. God's yes. history. Yes. Amen. That's the beginning of the. That's the Old Testament. Uh -oh. and the, new. the the other end of the uh, Bible is right. the Book of Revelation. Okay. Yes. And uh, the Revelations also talk about a, a place where the end time war will happen oh. in the plains of uh, Megiddo. Megiddo. Yeah. We, we 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 saw, we 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 witnessed that it was it is really a tremendous flat plain. Malaki, ma ma that's right, that's right. And you see, you, you know that that time is coming. 
Oh, yeah, the time yeah, is coming. You know? So, already, no? so this is. Uh, I th I think uh, for every uh, Christ lover, yes, a disciple of the Lord, people who love the Lord Jesus, you no, know, I think um, kahit minsan once in our lifetime, we must. Let's make it uh, part of our bucket list to come <laughs> to okay. Israel mm -hmm. to witness for ourselves, to experience, but more importantly, to bring our love and our blessing to the Israel nation. Because that is a commandment of the Lord. To love His people. To bless His people. Amen. So something we don't appreciate uh, enough. Okay? And, uh, but that is in the heart of God. Amen. Yeah. Wonderful. And, uh, and uh, you know, the more, the more we connect with the land of Israel and uh, with the Israel people, the more we find ourselves becoming whole, you know, because uh, <clears throat> if you look at the Bible, yeah, it says that uh, the time he's going to make for himself the one new man, the one new man, the one new man, okay. you know, the, the wild uh, olive tree, olive branches, and the natural olive branches coming together to come up with the one new man, and then when it comes together, uh, it is called the fullness of time, a completion. Okay, so tayo, we are called the Gentile Church. We will never be complete by ourselves until the chosen people of the Lord returns. What wonderful. And recognize who the Messiah is. And so we need to pray for that. We need to bless Israel because we will never be complete. We will only be complete when they return. When that time returns, when then? So uh, I, I'm learning to appreciate this, mm. and uh, we are we are we are all one, you know, in the family of God. Amen. We cannot be one; cannot be without yeah, the other. Hard. You know, and and try if you think about it, if we are part of the same body and we and we hurt one another, you know, you try to imagine your own body. If one part is hurting the other. It affects all. Ah, <laughs> that's right, you know. The totality. Yung, yung, yung masakit ng ipin oh, lang. Oo, nagbulutan eh. nga ako, naalala ko yun. Uh, it affects <laughs> the whole of us. So, we, we, you know, we need to understand that. Yes. In fact, I was going over your, ano, no, yung nangyari sa inyo doon, yung Jerusalem March. This was supported by the people there? Yes. Wow. Yes, uh, I think for out. me, that is uh, every year, that's the highlight of my the visit. Oh. You know, being able to okay. the look into the faces oh. of uh, our beloved uh, family there, mm -hmm. the Israelites. You know, you see uh, the faces of the, even the Orthodox Jews. Really? Uy, yeah. Mahirap yung you will see, mahirap you will see tears in their eyes. Really? And they will say, oh, thank you, thank you for fact. coming to bless us. Thank you for coming oh, to wow, our wow. land, you know. And when they say that, you you can sense all the all the sincerity of their heart. Tremendous, huh? You See know? that. And so it wow. it is really worth it. It's worth it. Yeah. God is doing the miracle already. Right, and uh, He's changing hearts. The best way to Him for us to uh, help them back to Him. Yeah. You no, know, to pray for them. To experience mm. the love of God. Mm, to share to love them oh, tama ka. with sincerity mm, yeah. right whatever so brother Albert uh, yeah, we are about to end again ang bilis ang panahon uh, what can you say in, in a nutshell ano yung yung impact ng ano, tours nyo sa Israel on Jesus reigns no? during the feast of tabernacles we we uh, we, we go there with mm -hmm. a very uh, a very intentional heart Okay. To be a blessing, to love Israel, yes, uh, and at the same time to to go there to surrender ourselves again. You know, because if that surrender, yeah, if, yeah. if right now, mm. you know, we need to understand that the, the spiritual throne of the Lord, you know, it's a, the spiritual significance of Jerusalem being the future throne room of the Lord. Then uh, we go there with the heart of uh, just surrendering a, 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 an act of surrendering our lives there and to pray there, to worship there. Uh, we will receive so much in return. 
you know, of course, all of these things are invisible things. We're talking about spiritual things. Yeah, right, right. You know, right, um, right. I'm reminded of uh, Psalm 24. Okay, yes. In Psalm 24, it says, Who can ascend the hill of the Lord? Oh, I like that. Ano. Okay. Psalm Only those with uh, pure hearts yeah. and clean hands. Clean hands. Yeah, I love right? that song. Uh, we're Tantanan. not perfect, mm -hmm. but it is because of the grace of the Lord, the righteousness of God that washes us clean, yeah. that uh, allows us to, to come into the presence of God. You know, Amen. so it's like every time you go to Israel, Jerusalem, no, if you come with that heart, then you come somehow closer. No, you draw closer to the presence of God. Sa totoo yun, uh, even even uh, non-religious people, every time they step step into the land of Israel, they sense a different environment. There is something in the air. The air is fresher. The mood is lighter. You, you look at the environment, you feel that indeed it is a blessed land. Amen. You know, know. just to be there. And yes, we will, we, we can, we will receive good gifts in Israel. Spiritually, spiritual that's very important. Wow, no, and but mm. also our phys, phys, uh, physically, we will be refreshed, uh -oh. and we can bring those good gifts back home, and we will become a better blessing to our own families, our own community, you know. And uh, for me, like this, you no, know, I, I hope that uh, <laughs> this opportunity to share with your audience this morning is a blessing to them. Amen. But I, I I can only do this because of my personal experience in in yeah. Israel. Yeah, you know I'm talking about what I personally experienced, and oh, uh, that's why I could I could share it like this. Can, can you say hello to our Kababayans? There we're live. Uh, we're being seen in Israel right oh, now. Yes. <laughs> Shalom, dear brothers and sisters, <laughs> in the land of uh, oh, our Lord you. Israel. Yes. Shalom to you. Shalom. shalom. God bless. God bless. Oh, wonderful. Yes. Well, uh, brother, we're about, we're about to uh, to conclude the uh, Good News Filipinas, no? Um, I would I would like to um, I don't know if you you know this song, brother Albert, mm -hmm. yung ng Maranata. Mm -hmm. um, can can you know? Uh, okay, um, I would like to to uh, give this song to God, and uh, with brother, my brother Albert. This is uh, given by the Maranata singers. It reminds us of the book of Exodus when when God appeared to Moses in the burning bush, you know? and uh, He was asking, "What will I, what name will I give them?" And He says, uh, "Tell them the the I am sent you, and this is my name. This is my name, my name forever, by which I am." To be remembered from generation to generation. This is my name. I am. This is my name. My name forever by which I am. To be remembered from generation to generation. This is my name. I am. To God be the glory. Amen. Hallelujah. To we'll always end uh, the good news with the word of God. In Numbers uh, 6, 24, 26, this is a priestly blessing. Hallelujah. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace. Shalom. Shalom. Shalom, Philippines. Shalom, Filipinas. <laughs> Shalom, Israel. Shalom, God Israel. be the glory. Amen. God bless. Radio Bandido, 8 to 10 a.m.